All right, I'm gonna show you guys 10 interesting clothing sales that are selling for me right now on eBay. I have 44 items going out for $1,351.98. I'm just gonna show you 10 of those sales. All right, first up we have this Oak Hill jacket. Uh, jacket like blazer sport coat size six, uh, 58R or 4XL. The US size is 4XL and it's like this blue plaid pattern. I picked up a bunch of these and they all sold. This one sold for $52 uh, plus $9 shipping. Took a best offer um, or someone sent a best offer and then I countered with $51.99. I picked up a couple of these. Um, some of them sold for like $60 plus shipping and then this one I took an offer. Uh, pretty good brand. Their button-ups and stuff like that don't sell super well, but their blazers, um, especially in these bigger sizes, seem to do pretty well. I'm not 100%, but I believe this brand's like a bigger size men's brand. I don't know if they make smaller stuff. I've only found their bigger stuff, so I just kind of assumed um, that's kind of a bigger size brand. Uh, but yeah, blazers do super well. I've sold like sweaters and stuff too. It's not like an amazing brand, but there's certain items that do sell really well. and these bigger size blazers are definitely one of them, especially if they have a good pattern like this. And I think I only paid $5 for these, five to $8, something like that. But I remember they weren't super expensive. So yeah, great sell there. If you guys want these awesome colored poly bags, please check out gyro pack and use the promo code Ronning 10 for 10% off first order. One of the only ways I monetize the channel, check them out, good company. They make awesome poly bags, check them out. All right, we have this Manchester United soccer jersey. It's, uh, it was a Ronaldo jersey, size XL, sold for uh, $65 plus $6 shipping. Uh, weighted on this one, ended up getting full price. Um, so, you know, Probably could have. I don't. I don't remember getting any offers for it, um, even low ball. So I don't know. I would have taken a best offer, but uh, yeah, took a little while to sell and sold for full price. <clears throat> Soccer jerseys, definitely look them up. I've sold a lot recently, especially in this past like month. So maybe because I've been finding them a bunch. So yeah, if you find soccer jerseys. Football jerseys, definitely check them out. Um, I, or, what was that? I sold a bunch of rugby jerseys lately. Um, yeah, I don't know. Any jerseys, guys. Look them up. You can see a little brand right there. Some Viore pants. These were corduroy pants. Um, they were size medium and sold for $33 plus $9 shipping. So very good sale, almost a total of $45. Fiori, great brand. Um, I think I sold a couple of their items this <clears throat> um, over the weekend. So yeah, great brand. Pants, shorts, shirts, pretty much anything from this brand is going to sell well. There's not really much to say about it. I would just kind of like pick up everything. Um, as long as you can pay a good price for it going to sell and make you some money. I feel so much better. Our kiddo is 10 weeks old. Going on 10 weeks old. I'm finally able to get like decent sleep. He's sleeping for like, you know, four hour like chunks at a time. In one night he slept seven hours. Just crazy. First two months he's sleeping no longer than like an hour. So feeling a lot better ready to rock this morning. All right, we have a pair of Built Shorts, BYLT, size 36, sold for $27 plus $9 shipping, so $38 shipped. I believe I paid $7 for these Built, it is an amazing brand. Another one of those, I would kind of just pick up anything you see. Um, yeah. It's a great brand. Every, pretty much everything from them sells. As long as you can pick it up for a good price, you will profit. Super good brand. Sold a ton of their, ton of their stuff. T-shirts, um, button-up shirts. T-shirts don't go as much for as much as they used to, or they don't sell as quickly, I feel like, as they used to. Um, 
just this kind of the nature of t-shirts but all their other stuff sells pretty quick all right next up we have this tommy bahama floral 100 percent silk shirt and it has a uh, virginia tech logo anything like this that has colleges on it or teams on it or anything like that tommy bahama um, makes a lot of stuff for um, teams. So yeah, that stuff does pretty well. Sold for $30 plus $6 shipping. Uh, took a best offer. I think I had it listed at 35 and some in the comps were selling for more, but for Tommy Bahama, I thought it was a pretty good sale. 30 bucks, pretty good. Ah, it's so hot in here. I can't wait for this heat to be over. Oh, I don't know why I live in Arizona. It is wild. All right, we got another blazer for you guys. I've been really into the blazer category. Um, I've just been getting them fair for fairly cheap in the thrifts because they price them too high and I get them off on like half off day. I wanna, I wanna say I paid five to seven dollars for this and sold for $40 plus $9 shipping. It is a Lauren Ralph Lauren blazer, size 46S. So it is a short size. Um, yeah, if you're like new to blazers, you just gotta look inside uh, the pocket. It'll tell you the size. Even these like not so great brands. I mean, Lauren Ralph Lauren's like, okay. But <clears throat> the blazer category is just so good. If you can pick them up for good prices, if your thrift store has them at good prices, a lot of them do really well. I've been really diving into it lately um, and it's been really working out for me. So definitely check out the blazer category and it's uh in the summertime so these are all selling in the summertime which is crazy because it is hot but you know wedding season people are getting married so people need suits they need blazers sport coats whatever and yeah these are doing well for me all right we have this garnet hill sweater it is a hundred percent cashmere size small garnet hill is a an okay brand. I've sold it quite a bit. It's not like amazing, but the fact that this is cashmere definitely adds value to it. Sold for $31.50 plus $6 shipping. And uh, yeah, I want to say I paid like five bucks for this. If you guys are new to this, definitely look up anything cashmere. Uh, this brand, you know, would I have picked up this exact same item if it was cotton? I don't know. Probably not. Size small, plain black. I don't know. I don't know if I would have. So the fact those cashmere definitely help the value, but I do pick up this brand if it's like a larger size or a pretty cool item um, or colorful or whatever. So yeah, Granite Hill, decent brand, but definitely look up cashmere stuff. And it's super lightweight, weighs nothing. So it's gonna be super cheap to ship out. All right, we got a pair of True Religion jeans, women's size 29, skinny. Pretty much I'm picking up anything True Religion men's uh, with women's stuff. You got to kind of look it up. Not everything sells. I don't know. True Religion is a weird one where sometimes when you type stuff in, it says it's like there's a ton listed with very uh, not very many sold. So it's kind of hard to look up data on True Religion. I don't really know why that is. If you guys have an idea of why that is, let me know. Um, I try to do the parentheses method and all that kind of stuff. And for whatever reason, True Religion is just a weird one where it just doesn't seem to pop up correctly. So I just kind of pick up everything True Religion and throw it in the system. And yeah, sure enough, sold for fairly, almost instantaneously for $30 plus $9 shipping. And I'm paying less than $10 for today. I think this was seven bucks. So yeah, pretty good sale there. All right, next up we have this Eileen Fisher 100% linen, uh, Irish linen skirt, size 2X. Sold fairly quickly for $28 plus $6 shipping. Eileen Fisher, great brand, but it is 100% linen and it's a bigger size 2X. So it kind of had everything going for it. Um, maybe I could have 
gotten more for it. I think I took a best offer, so um, of 28 bucks. So I think I had it listed for more. So maybe not. But I think Fisher, decent brand. I feel like over the years it's kind of slowly not as good as it used to be, but still a great brand, especially yeah with those bigger sizes and um, linen stuff. It's gonna do well over like a cotton skirt. This is a new brand for me. It is Narona shorts, cargo shorts. They're like outdoor hiking shorts. Sold very quickly for $30 plus $9 shipping. So sold for $40.74 and it had a bunch of holes in it. So uh, I think these were going for like more like $50 or $60 plus shipping. And I just decided to price it competitively so it would sell since it did have some flaws. And sure enough, it did. It sold fairly quickly. So, super cool brand. I've never found it before. It just looked like it had a lot of, like, you know, zip pockets. And it was, like, quality and had a lot going for it. So, sure enough, you look it up and it goes for, for money. So, you know, if you've been doing this for a while, you kind of start just seeing things, seeing patterns of, of quality. And it was kind of like a no-brainer to look something like this up. Uh, but, yeah, it's a new one for me. Cool little brand. All right, that is 10 items for you guys. I gotta head out and finish shipping, go sourcing, come home, list the new items. So yeah, I'm gonna get to it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know if you found something new or interesting um, or not, doesn't matter. Uh, please like and subscribe if you like the video. Peace out guys.